Good evening, everyone. Welcome. So for those of you that don't know me, my name is Courtney Sharples. I am the Platinum Leader of Team Twilight. And today we're going to go ahead and go over affiliate links where you can find them in order to go ahead and post them on your social media platforms. So the first one I do like to mention is what you you're probably already have access to. And that is going to be your, your Evo website. And if everybody, has everybody here been, already got this registered? And already set up? Okay. So we do have trainings on this as well, but most of this is pretty already set up. But if you scroll down, you can see they're going to be able to book flights, hotels, and rental cars all without even speaking to you. You're just going to have this link posted on your social media platform. So it could be posted directly, or maybe you have something like a link tree or milkshake or something where you can post all of your links in one spot. What I like to show you about your Evo site, as I said, you can book flights, hotels, and rental cars without speaking to you. Something you might want to do is if it's something that you're going to book directly for them, it has a, a section here that's got specials. Now, it does get updated for you, but if you yourself are not big on what special they've listed and want to personalize it yourself, there is a way you can actually go in here and edit it and update it to what you would like for those specials. And you can have up to two specials. So you can choose maybe one cruise and an all-inclusive or you could choose all-inclusive and maybe a tour or something like that that's going to be up to you so you can kind of personalize this if you don't like what it has here that they automatically put down but this is what you register for and you do need to complete your certification prior to registering this website in order to have clients go ahead and look around on it in order to book those flights hotels and rental cars any questions on your evo site give you a second to just put a response into the chat if need be just want to make sure there's no questions before i move on okay so the next one that you're going to have that's an affiliate link is going to be golden tickets. Now, as you can see on the top, it's going to have all kinds of different things that clients are able to book. So they have concerts, theater tickets. So like these are just a couple of the musicals and, and shows they have, as well as NFL, MLB, NBA. Now, there are specific instructions to register for this through the Travel Cafe. And what's great with this is once you register, it takes about... I'd say about 24 to 48 hours to go live. And usually it's just your first name, your last name, dot golden tickets dot com. So once you have it registered, you're able to go ahead and I would say double check it before you post in your social media platform because you don't want to have it all set up and then all of a sudden they're not able to book yet, right? So usually within about 24 to, to 48 hours. They do have featured ones each month as well. And with these, depending on what you have going on, you can also embed them into it. So if you decide to create your own website art outside of Evolutions, or sometimes you can embed it in other things as well. So you could even sometimes embed it with your Facebook. So there's a couple different ways you can. So you can pick to choose to feature these ones, or maybe there are some agents that are really into specific artists. They've come and found the tickets on here. And then they mainly post those on social media. So it's up to you what you feel most comfortable with. But this one here takes about 24 to 48 hours once you register. And it's one of those few suppliers that you are going to register for as soon as you join. So you should already have access to it. Does anybody have any questions about golden tickets? Like I said, this is going to be mainly for activities like concerts and theater tickets as well as sporting events. If you have a question, don't be afraid to go ahead and put it in the chat. I'm always happy to add an answer make sure, to make sure you understand.
Everybody set with golden tickets? Yep, so Lauren, when you're registering, it's going to ask you to create it, and you're just going to put your usually your first name and your last name. So it'll be, um, for mine, it's CourtneySharples.GoldenTickets.com. Um, so we don't really have the marketing content for this one, Chelsea, but there are many of our suppliers that do. Um, on my YouTube channel, I do have a training on where to find the free marketing material. You can definitely go ahead and catch that, and it will show you where you can find a lot of the different suppliers. The next one's going to be Viator. So there's a couple of things with um, Viator. There's going to be two different links that you're able to go ahead and share. So the first one, when you log in, is going to be just the main screen. So if you click this one that clicks share with client, it's just going to be in a generic page. It's going to be all kinds of activities. Now, Viator is one of those that when you're registering for them, you do not use Archer's IATA number. Instead, you are using, there's a P number that you can kind of see that's right here. That, and that is listed in the back office in the Travel Cafe. So if you're like, okay, I can't figure this out. I'm not sure how to register. That is back there that can assist you in registering for it. So they'll just copy this. You can post it in the social media platform and clients can come in here and book activities. When the client books on here, as well as golden tickets, you're going to receive an email. So when you receive that email, you want to make sure to go in right away and fill out that commission tracking form. The only um, the only downside when you're filling out the commission tracking form is when the client contacts, like when you get the client that books and you get that email, it does not provide all of their contact information. So when you're filling out that commission tracking form, you'll have like their first list name, but you might not have their email address, their phone number. So you're going to end up putting in your own information so you can put that through but they you will still get paid um you just want to make sure you get that information from that booking like the the total as well as that commission amount if the other link another way you can share a link you might want to promote certain things so let's say uh, for example i'm really big with harry potter so i'm just going to choose this one here but if you want a specific kind of tour they have videos in here you can actually embed. So some of these will let you kind of take them from there. Um, so if you were to like click here, you can you can kind of sh get information from here. You can actually go to YouTube and grab the video from there. Um, these are ones you can use. I have one something like this on my website, but you can use these. But what's great is if you want to promote a specific excursion similar to the main page, you can have this here that says share with client and it's gonna, it'll say London Warner Brothers tour. So it kind of narrows it to that specific one. You can also focus mainly on specific locations. So if they want things to do in London, these are all kinds of activities to do in London. So usually what I do is if I'm on that main page, I'll come in here and I'll type in London, you pick dates, you, I usually say book something a little bit out because they may not actually end up booking right away, but just to pick a random one and click apply. And if you click search, you have another link right here. And so it's kind of three different ways that you can kind of get a link through here. And if you click share with client, it's going to narrow it down just to London excursion. So if you have somebody that is looking to go to Mexico and looking for things to do, you can search Mexico as well. And you can actually copy and share this link up here. And they can look through all Mexico excursions to see what it is that they're interested in to be able to go ahead and book. Any questions about Viator? Okay. 
this one is one that I'd like to go ahead and show. It's not, they can't really book themselves on it, but I like to show it because they are trying to promote the cruise line right now. So let me go ahead and sign in. This is going to be with Royal Caribbean. So if you want to be able to follow along on your own as well, go ahead. So you're going to sign in. And this one that we're going to be doing is going to be promoting their new ship that's only been out for a little while. So if you go under sales and marketing, the very top option is going to say discover icon of the seas. You're going to go ahead and you're going to click that. It's going to play a little bit of a video. You can feel free to go ahead and watch it. Or you can just skip that video. But it kind of gives a little bit about that cruise. And with here, it has a link here that says share with your clients. So if you right now, you can see it, it doesn't have necessarily the information you might want to share. So if you click share with clients, it'll bring you to this box down here where you can actually go ahead and change whatever information you want. So like I can come in here and I can put in my, my all of my information. So it's got my, my email, my phone number, and then you can put your company name as well and then it will have a link so if we scroll down just a little bit so it'll say i'm basically we're pleased to reveal the newest chip you're going to click share with your clients so if i come down here and paste this link it's going to start the same way with that video of the cruise ship but when they get here, they're going to be able to narrow this down. So if they kind of scroll down, it's going to give them a bit of information about the cruise ship. So it's got all kind of the, all the thrills that are on the ship. It's got their chills, like their pools and whatnot. Um, it's got different wow. So maybe some of their different shows, their nightlife also has their their rooms that they can kind of explore rooms as well. And then kind of go down, it will show their family fun. So they just kind of keep scrolling. And as they get towards the bottom here, it's going to give them an idea of some of those costs. So it's got your contact information again and where they can select information for specific dates for that cruise ship. So some of these will sell out rather quickly. But with this here, it's not them actually booking on it. Okay. So they can kind of look at the cost to see what it's like. And then let's say they wanted this Western Caribbean one here. They can actually click on this here and it's going to give them some details like where it's going to go. So they're able to see where they're going to be visiting. But then they can make a request and they're going to fill this out. And then it's going to notify you that somebody wants to go ahead and take a look at that. And you're going to be able to put together a quote for that exact ship. Um, scroll up in, in this one here. So where it can also see your information. I just wanna make sure I'm not missing what you're looking for. And so it'll have your contact information and then a place where they can start looking at the different options. Awesome. Any questions with Royal Caribbean with their new ship, the Icon of the Seas? Did everybody see how I got to there to make sure they understand so they can go ahead and create it themselves? Okay. So the next one's going to be with Virgin Voyages. So this is going to be one that they actually themselves can book on. Oh, looks like my password expired. So just bear with me here one second. Let's see if I've used that password before. Okay, 
So to get your link with Virgin Voyages, where it says your name in the top right hand corner, you're going to click it to bring down a drop down and you're going to click on my profile. So once it brings you here, you're going to go ahead and scroll down, continue scrolling till it gets the personal details. And it's going to say first mate link. You're going to copy that link. So if you want to see what it looks like, you copy that link. You can actually go po paste it, open any tab so you can kind of see for yourself. But it's going to bring up a page where they're actually going to be able to go ahead and book. So they can look at different types of rooms, whether it's, so this one here right now is a deal, 70% 70, 70 off a second sailor and free balcony upgrade. So they can kind of pick locations they're looking to go. And they'll be able to actually book on here themselves. Um, how to find the one for Virgin Voyages again, Rebecca? Just want to make sure I'm understanding. Is that the one you're looking for again? Um, golden ticket is going to be in the travel cafe for how to register. And then your website will end up, once you register, it will end up being your first and your last name dot golden tickets dot com. The link is just going to be what's in the, the top browser. And it's just going to be your first name, your last name dot golden tickets dot com is how you're advised to register. Any questions on Virgin Voyages? Everybody set with that? Um, yes, Jason is going to be posted after as well. The next one here is going to be Disney itself now with disney it's not going to be a site they can book on themselves but you're basically creating a mini site so they can see what it is that you're able to sell so what you'll do is you're going to go under marketing tools when you're signed in and there's this option right here that says disney site builder e-brochure mini site what we're going to go over is going to be a mini site i'm going to go ahead and show you mine i'm not going to create a new one but i'm going to show you what at like how you yourself would set it up if you have not already so we're going to manage one that we already have so you're going to get to put your company name so you can use that as the top as your mini site title and it's going to give you a couple options for how you want the template to be so you can kind of pick which option you do want and if we go up to the top there's languages and brands so obviously, for those of you that speak English, you're going to have that in your main language, and you're going to be able to pick which of these you want on here. So if you want the Nat Geo on there, you can have all of these, or you can put maybe, if you only want to focus on like Disneyland and Disney World, you can put just those two, or you can have all of these featured on there. Your contacts, you're going to put all your contact information on here, so you can connect it to your Facebook page, your Insta, your Pinterest, uh, you, you can put your YouTube channel in there as well as Twitter, if you have it as well. So these are all your social media links you can actually connect to your Disney mini site that clients can click on as well. Logo, some people have had their luck putting a logo on there. I have not, if not, it's not a big deal. Um, sometimes Disney will allow it, sometimes they won't. And then you're gonna limit the content. So me personally, I just list everything that's on here but you can pick and choose what you want on here as well. So if you click the down arrow, so they have Walt Disney Resort and they break it down to theme parks, water parks, uh, places to stay. It's gonna break all of that down for you. So you can choose to list all of that or you can narrow it to very little. And then you're also able to choose the style as well. So you can pick the color as well as how, the, how it's gonna look. So it kind of gives you an example here. And it will go ahead and give you like a preview and publish option. 
you can view how it's going to look on a computer as well as on a cell phone because we all know that things look different on a computer a phone than they do a computer so you can click view in a new tab it will open it up and this is what they're going to see so it's going to have your company at the top you can select a destination so if you want to do a disney world you can click disney world and it has like embedded videos into it as well. There's special offers, so they can go ahead and see what special offers. And this is why you want to share it because it's going to show what offers you're able to kind of assist them with. So right, right now it's to save up to 30% on rooms. That's select Disney Resort Hotels. Um, there's also Vis Disney Visa card members. They have delicious perks as well. They have them for Florida residents. They have four-day four-park magic tickets. So there's a bunch of different deals that you're able to book for them as well. So you want to be able to have that listed on the page. Very important for them to know. And then if you scroll down as well, it's gonna they can explore the theme parks, the water parks. They can explore places to stay, things to do. They can explore all of this. And there's packages as well so that they can view packages. So you can choose to have it narrowed down for just one location like Disney World or you can do Disneyland, Alani. You can kind of narrow it to whatever it is that you yourself would like. So it's just another website. Yes, they can't book on it, but they are. it is an affiliate link that they can actually click on to see a little bit more about those locations, especially that if they haven't done Disney themselves yet. So they can learn a little bit more. And it has some of their resorts as well. So many times you'll find if they're looking to do the resorts, they might want these value resorts. And they have a bunch of them that they can kind of stay at. And these are usually not super expensive. Any questions with Disney? No questions on Disney and its mini site. All right. And the last one that we're going to go over. Now, has everybody been here at least three months and have access to sandals already? Or are some of you kind of still waiting? Okay, yes, not yet. Okay. So with the um, sandals, it is updated. It used to be you had to wait six months to be able to get access. They have recently changed it where you only have to be here three months in order to gain access. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. They have a couple different affiliate links. And so when you log in, going to bring you to this screen here. So if you want to find where your affiliate links for it are going to be, you're going to click on where it says your account. And there's this option that says co-brand profile. This is where all of your links are going to be. And there's quite a few links. So it looks like there's a lot. Um, when you think about it, there's, there's the same amount of links because they have them for sandals and peaches because sandals is for adult only. So it depends if you want to focus on only adults or if you want to focus and do beaches, which also has kids as well. So if maybe maybe weddings are your thing, you're going to copy this link here. And you would open that up into a new tab. And it's going to have everything about the weddings. So it's going to show their aisle to aisle. They have different packages. They also have a test drive your wedding that they're able to do as well. And it gives them all information about that as well. And they can actually, and you can use this for them to be able to do that. They also have frequently asked questions. So this one's specifically just for weddings. They also have links that are specifically for honeymoons. So you can choose, maybe weddings aren't your thing. You're kind of learning and honeymoons are a little bit easier than weddings. They do have them for honeymoons as well. So they have different honeymoon packages as well at different locations. So they can kind of narrow that down as well. So it lets them know everything that's included. 
spa experiences and tours and stuff like that, free honeymoon packages. So it depends. Sometimes when they do their wedding there, they can get stuff towards that free honeymoon. So there's a couple different options as well. And then they do have golf as well. That one, you probably won't get as many hits with this one here, uh, but it is there for depending on which, like which population you're looking to go ahead and share with. And then this one, they've only had out for a couple months. But this is a good one to go ahead and promote as well, especially if you're looking to promote sandals. And this one is where it gives an additional 10% to basically firefighters, military, police, as well as those for FEMA. And really what they would have to do in order to get that is basically they book their stay and you're gonna they're going to submit this form. And once they verify it, they're going to basically get a credit upon their verif their booking. Because with sandals, you don't necessarily have to pay for the whole thing up front. Some of the times you can hold it for a small amount. Um, I can't remember off the top of my head, but they can book it for a small amount. And then they, with not having it paid, it'll be very easy for them to go in and apply that credit. It just means that would be less that they are owed. So it does ask for like their information, their country, their first and last name, date of birth, their branch of service, and they can submit it. And anything that they need, Sandals will go ahead and reach out to ask them for it. So with this here, it will ask for details. So if they want somebody, so this one here is active FEMA for firefighters. It is active, retired, and retired, inactive U.S. and Canadian firefighters. So for FEMA, it's going to have to be active, but some of these other ones, it will say active or retired. So if you just click on it, it will kind of give you those details. But FEMA is one of those that it specifically says active. But it would be benefits for one. So they're not going to get like a 20%. It's going to be just that additional 10%. Many of these rooms are already sometimes 65% off the, the rack rate. And they usually give them additional credits as well. So that 10% is, is still a nice discount because it's something that others are not going to, to get. Any questions on sandals? And then, yes, they do, do have the generic link as well that will have everything on there that they can kind of go to. So if you don't want to specify, spe specify a specific one, you can just share the generic link and that will go ahead and they can kind of look at the top to narrow it down. And they can scroll that way. Any questions on sandals? Okay, so we did go ahead and close them. If you have any other questions about any of the other ones as well, feel free to go ahead and put them in the chat. I'd be happy to go ahead and answer your questions or go ahead and...